It's Thursday, July 26, 2012. I'm TC Sadek, son of Jarrell and host of today's 90 Seconds on the Verge. Google has assimilated Kansas City into the mothership. The company today began its rollout of Google Fiber, promising speeds of 1,000 megabits per second and no data caps for an incredibly reasonable $70 a month. For those keeping track, that's approximately 20 times faster than Time Warner's fastest offering. Residents can also get a slower internet for free, provided they pay the $300 installation fee. If that wasn't enough, Google also became a cable TV company today. For $50 more, you can get access to hundreds of HD channels and can record up to eight shows at the same time. Google is releasing Android and iOS apps to serve as the remote control, and there's even a free Nexus 7 tablet included in the TV package. While the channel list is expansive, there are some notable holes. AMC, HBO, and ESPN are currently not on the list. In fact, there is nothing at all from Time Warner or Disney. Thankfully, though, Viacom properties like Comedy Central and MTV did make the list. It's not clear yet if Google will expand its service across the country, but for the first time ever, Kansas City has become the envy of the entire United States. Finally, in other news today, the internet imploded. Netflix, Twitter, and even Google's own chat service went down at various points. All three are once again working, so you can go back to watching old episodes of Breaking Bad and sharing way too much about what you ate earlier today. And that's it for today's top stories. Tune in tomorrow where we'll show you how police are using simple off-the-shelf mind readers to violate your right to privacy.